I am the rocket man they talk about. I jump from star to star, I walk it out. Hey guys, Shibby here, playing some Modern Warfare 3 on the PC. So we're going with our MP5 gold camo, which is the first gun that I really liked in the game. Someone said, hey Shibs, check out the MP5. It's a pretty decent SMG, it's not overpowered like the ump or anything like that, so I'm like, alright, so if it's a fair and balanced weapon, I'll check it out, that way, you know, if I kill someone with it, they're not going to be raging, so that's good. And that's one thing that a lot of people do not consider in a game, is balance. That's the, probably the most difficult thing for a developer to do, is to balance every gun, every aspect of the game, that way it's fun and fair for everyone. What I look for in a game when it comes to balance is, if someone kills me, I know they killed me because they outplayed me, it's not that they're exploiting some part of the game, and that's why I died. Some terminology in game balance that you guys should know is in role-playing games, typically people say GIMP, which means a character, a character class, or character ability is underpowered in context of the entire game, so it's, they lack effectiveness compared to other characters, so it's like, oh man, I always play as the Rocket Man because the, the Sucky Man always sucks, like, I don't know, just an example. So that is the GIMP. Now we have to talk about the nerf, which is when we need something to be reduced or turned down something that's too effective in the game that obviously needs nerfing. Once again, that is reducing the desirability or effectiveness of a particular game element. One well-known instance of nerfing is from Infinity Wards. We're talking about Call of Duty when the model 1887s in Modern Warfare 2 were not nerfed. They were able to one-shot kill pretty much anyone at medium to long range while other shotguns were limited to medium to short range. So they were nerfed to reduce the range that they were effective at. So that's kind of an example within Call of Duty. The last major term you need to be aware of in game balance is overpowered, often abbreviated to OP, letter O, letter P, which basically is the lack of game balance in certain aspects, such as a weapon being overpowered. Let's talk about the F2000 or the IRNV scope in Battlefield 3. That attachment or gun were clearly overpowered compared to all its competitors. All right, Shibs, that's pretty interesting. In your opinion, what is the most balanced game out there? Well, not tic-tac-toe, I'll say that for sure, but StarCraft, with the three races available, that being Terran, Protoss, and Zerg, is said to be perfectly balanced with each other. Personally, I'm not that big of a StarCraft player. I don't have any StarCraft II videos on YouTube. I do have the game, but I haven't really played it that much. And one thing that you guys need to know is when we're talking about game balance, is the reason why a game such as StarCraft is still popular, even when the first edition came out, so just, you know, straight up StarCraft 1, is it lasted for such a long time being released in 1998 because it was balanced. Because it's not like, oh, you gotta play Protoss, Protoss is way OP, that just rolls everyone. That's not how it worked. So let's talk about an example right now in Modern Warfare 3, that being the Type 95 Assault Rifle. It is clearly better than everything else in the game. It takes two shots, pretty much from any range or at least one burst, because it's a burst weapon, to, to wipe out anyone. So it's not like the ACR is even in competition, it's just the Type 95 is the best and hopefully they will balance that or they'll probably have to ban it in competition, kind of like the FAMAS. FAMAS Red Dot clearly overpowered. One thing I'd like to see more in multiplayer shooters is more variety in the guns that people actually use. Yes, any gun is good enough to kill someone, that's why it's in the game, obviously, it's not just some joke. If it was an option to run around and blow bubbles at your enemies, people would probably do it. I mean, I know I'd check it out one time, and I just thought about the Powerpuff Girls for some reason. I, I don't know, that's kind of strange. So, let's talk about competition, such as MLG, Major League Gaming, which, with Quantic, who I work with, so Quantic Media, Quantic Gaming, we have basically the best Call of Duty teams around who just, you know, won Providence and won $50,000 and all this good stuff, so that's great. However, it was all FAMAS Red Dot, and that was Black Ops, which is annoying to see. So one thing I'd like to see in competition they actually implement is you have to have, say, maybe one sniper on your team. Have a variety of guns instead of just everyone rolling FAMAS Red Dot. An interesting way to implement that would just be a rule set, saying everyone has to do something different. This is one reason why Halo was pretty interesting to watch from a spectator standpoint is there was only one rocket launcher on the map or one or two sniper rifles so it's not like everyone was running around with the same sniper or the same battle rifle I mean unless they had the rule set where you spawn with it so it just you know it mixes it up and keeps it interesting sometimes I am harsh or critical on a game or in a video just saying something sucks or needs to be fixed it's not so much that I'm just angry but it's because I want to change so I'm actually playing that game years down the road 
once again. That's why StarCraft lasted so long. That's why it's so popular. Yeah. Yeah, and an interesting kill cam, I'm not going to lie. So the guy runs by to trigger my bouncing Betty, and the guy coming up the stairway gets a face full of it and then flies back down the stairs. So <laughs> that was pretty funny. So, yeah, I ended that 30 and 11. Not like I'm really good or anything, but, you know, just a little something to talk about and golden MP5. So there you go. That's it, guys. Make sure to subscribe for more rate and comment and game balance. Holla.